गुड मॉर्निंग एलेवेंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ स्टैंडर्ड साइंस स्टूडेंट टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट नीट प्लस सीईटी एग्जाम पैटर्न मल्टीपल चॉइस ऑब्जेक्टिव क्वेश्चंस इन फिजिक्स पेपर वन फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन what is the angular displacement of the minute hand in 20 minutes the options given are a pi by 3 radian b 2 pi by 3 radian c pi by 2 radian d 3 pi by 2 radian out of this four options the correct option is b and is answer 2 pi by 3 radian question number 2 the frequency of a particle performing circular motion changes from 60 revolution per minute to 180 revolution per minute in 20 second then the angular acceleration is first option 0.1 radian per second square second option b 0.2 pi radian per second square option number 3 c 0.3 pi radian per second square option number d 0.4 pi radian per second square in this options the b option even is correct that is 0.2 pi radian per second square question number 3 the angular displacement of seconds hand of a clock is 15 seconds in si unit is first option pi radian second option b 180 degree third option c 90 degree and fourth option d pi by 2 radian out of these four options the option d1 is correct pi by 2 radian fourth question if a car of mass 500 kg takes a round turn of radius 50 meter with a speed of 36 km per hour then the centripetal force acting on the car will be first option 500 newton second option 1000 newton third option c 150 newton option d 1200 newton out of these four option the option b1 is correct that is 1000 newton fifth question the maximum speed with which a vehicle can be safely driven along a curved road of radius r banked at an angle theta is first option a root of rg tan theta second option b rg tan theta third option c square root of rg by tan theta and fourth option d both a and b in all these four of options the option a one is correct that is square root of rg tan theta now question number 
a wheel starts from rest and acquires an angular velocity of 60 radian per seconds in half a minute then its angular acceleration is first option 4 radian per seconds square second option b 2 radian per second square third option c 1 radian per second square fourth option d 0.5 radian per second square in this four options the option b1 is correct that is 2 radian per second square now question number 7 the dimension formula of angular momentum is first option a square bracket m raised to 1 l raised to 2 t raised to minus 1 square bracket close second option b m raised to 1 l raised to 1 t raised to minus 1 square bracket close option c m raised to 1 L raised to one, T raised to minus two, square bracket close. D in square bracket, M raised to two, L raised to one, T raised to minus one, square bracket close. In all these options four, the option A one is correct. In square bracket, M raised to one, L raised to two, T raised to minus one. Now eighth question which of the following physical quantity has unit kilogram meter square per second first option a torque second option b moment of inertia third option c angular momentum and fourth option d Force. Out of these four options, the physical quantity is option C, that is angular momentum. Now, question number nine: A wheel of moment of inertia five into ten raised to minus three kg m square is. making 20 revolution per second if it is stopped in 20 seconds then its angular retardation would be first option a pi radian per second square second option b 4 pi radian per second square third option c 2 pi radian per second square Fourth option D, eight pi radian per second square. In all these four options, the option C one is correct. That is two pi radian per second square. Now come to the question number ten. A body of moment of inertia of three kilogram meter square. rotating with an angular velocity of 2 radian per second has the same kinetic energy as that of mass 12 kg moving with a velocity of first option a 1 meter per second second option b 2 meter per second third option c 4 meter per second and fourth option d 8 meter per second in all these four options the option a1 is correct that is the velocity is 1 meter per second the solution is given here as per the formula here half of i omega square is equal to half mv square therefore putting the values of i and omega and m mass 
we get the answer for that as here the first option as 1 meter per second please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel